Remembering a student set on becoming a basketball star, the family of an East Nashville teen shot and killed in cold blood, and her family believes it could be retaliation from an incident years ago. News Channel 5's Brandon Marshall spoke with Vestoria Lucas's mother before a candlelight vigil. How's the family doing tonight, Brandon? Yeah, Rory, good evening. The family of Vestoria Lucas tells me her death is unreal. A few days ago, they were making plans for her to attend prom, and now her family has to plan her funeral. Why? Oh, God. People cover the spot where 19-year-old Vestoria Lucas died at the Casey Holmes Apartments. They remember the young woman nicknamed Relly, a youth mentor who loved playing basketball with kids in her area. She was so loving and so caring, and everybody loved her. I mean, everybody, all in the community where we lived at. Memories of Vestoria getting good grades and playing point guard for Stratford High are what her mother now holds on to. Right now, she was trying to go to the prom. Mom, I got to get all my stuff for the prom. I want a white suit. I want this. Police charged 28-year-old Kevin Caprice Smith with criminal homicide after he admitted to shooting Lucas. Three years ago, Smith got into a fight with Lucas and her older sisters. He attacked her and everything. And when we thought it was over and we forgave him, he comes back and kills her. They believe yesterday's fatal shooting right next to the playground was premeditated. All the other kids around, he wasn't just trying to shoot any kid. After he shot her in one leg, shot her in the next leg, and watching her try to crawl away. Then he went up and shot her in the rest of her body. He meant to do exactly what he was doing. Vastoria wanted to attend either Vanderbilt or Trevecca and play basketball. Her family is still planning to celebrate her success in high school. We're still going to have a graduation party for her because our grades are good enough right now, and in two months, you know what I'm saying? It's not going to change enough where she can't graduate. A great celebration for a talented basketball star. Vistoria was on her way to church when she was shot and killed. And on Friday, her family and friends plan to hold another candlelight vigil. We are live at the East Precinct tonight. I'm Brandon Marshall, News Channel 5.